Thanks for joining us. I'm Timmy Alexander. And I'm Daniel Sparkman. Today marks a historic moment for the University of Alabama College of Communication and Information Sciences. As the brand new digital media center is opening at Bryant Denny Stadium. And soon, WVUA will call this new state of the art facility its home. First at 10 tonight, an inside look at the DMC. WVUA's Travis Leader was there for this evening's grand opening and has more. Hey, Travis. Hey guys, good evening. WVUA will soon be able to call Brian Denny Stadium home in just a few months. And the new center will be the birth of better news content to you, our viewers. You end up uh, feeling like uh, a big baby has just been born and it's a great feeling. We'll have more of that story for you in the next half hour of All Things Considered. Alabama Public Radio and the Center for Public Television are now fully operational in Bryant Denny Stadium. And interim dean Dr. Jennifer Greer says once WVUA moves in, the dream will fully become reality. We're really excited um, about WVUA moving in, which we're hoping will be done in the next couple of months, and that will make the new home complete for everyone. UA alumnus and retired ABC News senior correspondent John Cochran says aspiring broadcasters will be drawn into the brand new facility. It's just going to be a magnet for students. Who would not want to come to a state-of-the-art digital center and have classes, you know, in the north end zone at Bryant-Denny Stadium? And the DMC will provide students an experience you just can't learn in a classroom. It's just a wonderful to be close to actual workplaces for students, to be around the real world as well as, as be in the classroom. With continued innovation in the way we broadcast to your living room, some say the DMC will be an ever-evolving facility for future generations. At some point we'll be replanning and moving on with uh, an enhanced version of this studio 20 years from now. Now once our set is completed, we will broadcast all of our newscasts live from Brian Denny Stadium. We may even be on air when there are 101,000 fans inside for a football game. But thanks to our soundproof studio, you won't hear a thing. The Center for Public Television and Alabama Public Radio have already started operations at their new home. Travis Leader, WVUA News.